I just hit 600 subscribers on YouTube. To celebrate, I decided to get roasted. I needed the most generic fitness picture possible. I've been making YouTube videos for over 12 years now. After just surpassing 600 subscribers, I now consider myself a full-time YouTuber. I post fitness videos and challenges. The YouTube comment section can be a scary place, so our roast me should be easy. Give me your worst. But then it got declined, so I picked this picture. Hey, what's going on, guys? Russell Muscle here, back in with another video. We just got 600 subscribers. We gotta celebrate. That's a big milestone. Okay, we gotta try that again. One sec. Let's go! 600 subscribers special. We made it. Thank you guys so much for subscribing. If you haven't subscribed already, I don't know what you're doing here. This is a celebration video. Thank you guys so much. If you don't know already, my name is Brett Russell. This YouTube channel, Russell Muscle. We've been posting YouTube videos now for over 12 years. I don't know when this video is going to be published, but I actually got my 600 subscribers on September 25th, 2020. So I don't know what we did here today, but it's going to be super cringy. It's going to make me feel bad about myself. And we're just going to get bullied off the internet. The internet as a whole is a very toxic place. YouTube's a very toxic place. The comment sections can be really brutal sometimes, and they can just be super, super mean. And I thought, what's a better way to learn how to be a YouTuber than how to deal with the hate and deal with the haters? On Reddit, there's a subreddit called r slash roast me. Uh, it's supposed to be in a humorous way, but people roast you to the best of their ability, and it can be quite mean. Much, much, much later. Okay, the moment you've all been waiting for. Let's get roasted. Okay, let's start this off. 600 subscribers Canadian, there's only 450.75 US subscribers. <laughs> Funny. I'd rather shit in my hands and clap than call you a YouTuber. I post fitness videos and challenges. According to those bitch tits, it was determined that this was a lie. Okay, okay, okay. Hold on a second. These are not bitch tits. Biggest, biggest chest in the game. That's what we like to say here. And then the other comment under that was, I mean, don't lie. The guy's got gains. Thank you. You don't need to lie either. His muscles are the only thing he's got going for him. I also have the YouTube channel. 600 subscribers. Your parents must be so proud of the $5 you make per month. And that's Zimbabwean dollars. Fun fact, I don't make any money through YouTube, but I am still a full-time YouTuber. Gymshark, dot, 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 need I say more? Okay, I'm not gonna lie. Gymshark, I, I, I was a hype beast at once too. I'm working on something special. Working on my own um, gym clothing stuff. Hey man, that's 50 subscribers every calendar year. It's only gonna take you 10,000 years to reach half a million subscribers and may maybe be able to earn some money. Okay. Bro, for doing fitness videos, you need to have a body that someone would like to have. It's not about the outside. It's about how you feel on the inside. Health and wellness. Here's a challenge you can try. How about finding anything other than nails and tacks to use to put up the, all your hats and other shit in your room? Tacky as f What are you, 16? You know what? That's just rude. Like, everything else, it's fine, whatever, it's a joke. But, like, my wall and stuff, I don't know if you guys can see it, but it's nice. I like my room. It's it got, It's got, a, like, a little, little homely stuff. I made it feel like my own. I like my hats. You know, I like my lights, my Canadian flag. So, you know what? I don't write that one. Baseball hats as wall decoration is all we need to see here. Yeah, that's all you do need to see. It's a nice room. I've never had a bad comment about this room. It's all been compliments. People like the hats. Do you show your subs how, how to grow bitch tits? What's with the bitch tits in the hats? Okay, no, um, I don't think so. Well, leave a comment down below. Do I have a uh, bitch tits? I see your mom to make 600 YouTube accounts. Okay, fun fact there. She did not make 600 accounts, but I think my mom has like five or six accounts. She, uh, she plugs, she makes sure it goes. They have conversations with each other in the comments sometimes. I just made fun of myself. Dude, have you ever looked at the subscribers? It's your grandma's church circle trying to make you feel good. Okay, nope, that one's just a lie. But fun fact again with that, my grandma has a YouTube account and she watches most of my videos and subscribes. But then sometimes at the end of the videos when I say, hey, make sure you subscribe or whatever, she'll click the button again thinking she can do it more than once. So every once in a while, I'll lose a subscriber and gain a subscriber because it's her going back and forth. You're the embodiment. You're the embodiment. Embody Bot embodiment. Embodiment. You're the embodiment of every douche on Letterkenny. I feel like that's a compliment, no? What a great show. 10 out of 10, funny show, Canadian show. I definitely wouldn't leave my drink unattended around you. What's that supposed to mean? If your brain was as big as your neck, you would be smarter than Stephen Hawking. Honestly, I've read this one over like three times and I, I get it, they're making fun of like the size of my neck or something, but I, I don't get what they're trying to say. It looks like you have more neck than brain cells. What the what? Is, uh, biggest neck in the game. Who the f is that guy? I'm Russell <laughs> Muscle, okay? I don't know what's worse, the description of, or that you're wearing a Gymshark shirt. Yeah, that one's fair. A nice metaphor of a full-time homeless. No, nope, part-time homeless, full-time YouTuber. Joe Mariah Star, you look like you have a steady supply of Rofenol. What is Rofenol? What is Rofenol? Side effects. Oh, it's another date rape drug joke. That one one's too complicated. Like, if I have to Google up what it means, no. Low quality roast. Posting fitness challenges is an understatement. More like you can eat the most pizza. Then the thumbnail will be you, and the caption will say, 
Too many words. Hold on. Posting fitness challenge is an understatement. More like, who can eat the most pizza? Then the thumbnail will be you, and the caption will say, day three, and the video is 76 hours long. You know what? We're running out of video ideas. I might do this one. You're the guy that carries roofies everywhere. What's with the roofies jokes? I don't understand. If you're the Grim Reaper, I have Queen Elizabeth teach me her ways. If you were the Grim Reaper, I'd have Queen Elizabeth teach me her ways. Leave a comment down below what you think that means. I have no idea. Looks like you do push-ups in a push-up bra. Because I have the biggest chest in the game! Hat isn't hiding your hairline. He is guilty of hat fishing. See, I didn't know that was a thing. But yes, I wear a hat every single day. Um, yeah, I'm a hat guy. That that one's just that one's just true. Moving on. You got gains, but no row gains. What's with all these uh random words? What is Rogaine's. Minoctadol is a medication used for the treatment of high blood pressure and male pattern hairball. Oh, it's a joke about my hairline. Your eyes are further apart than your pecs and no workout is going to fix that. I've never, uh, really? I think my eyes are normal-ish, right? No, I'm starting to feel self-conscious. <laughs> nice tits. Biggest chest in the game. That hat still doesn't hide your giant ass forehead, which is ever increasing. I agree. 600 subscribers after 12 years. You're either a shit person in videos or just a shit person. Looks arrogant as fool. You look like you know that there is no hope for you in the smarts department, so you can prove your body hoping no one will notice. They do. You know what? I'm not, I'm just, I'm just gonna. Academical Canadian. That's all I gotta say there. And you know, I'm in university st studying kinesiology, just doing this YouTube full time on the side. We got, we're, we're grinding every day. Not even the woman's shirt can contain your tits. Biggest chest in the game. Never skip puffy nipples day. Biggest chest in the game. Okay, this is gonna be our last one. Did you skip arm day? And the second guy says, yep, decided to work out his lips and neck instead. I thought you had to be black to get lips in it that big. But apparently there's a machine for that. He skips every day. You can make fun of my hat. You can make fun of my neck. You can make fun of my chest. You can make fun of anything, but don't make fun of my lips, okay? That's all I gotta say. That's where we're gonna end it right here, guys. I don't even know what this video was. A big celebration, just a fun little roast video. Some of them hurt a little bit, not gonna lie, but I know most of them were just for humor. If you guys enjoyed this video, I'll give it a like, comment down below. What videos you want me to do? I'm starting to get lost with ideas and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. If you click right here, you'll get to see a Will Tennyson challenge, a really good video. And if you click this video right here, you'll get to watch the LeBron James ab workout, the MVP, the NBA final champion. Okay, I'll see you guys next time. Peace!